Once your photos have been uploaded to your job and calibrated, it's time to associate them to the proper nodes and sections. Open your office tools and click Associate Photos. There will be a toast at the bottom of your screen that will provide necessary information regarding the state of your photo association. If photos were accidentally uploaded to the wrong job, or you skipped uploading sync shots during the upload process, the toast will let you know that there are no photos to associate. If your photos were uploaded to the correct job but the sync shot was entered incorrectly, the toast will let you know how many photos were left unassociated. You can view your unassociated photos by clicking Show Unassociated Photos. You can drag your photos onto the correct nodes from the unassociated photo tray or catapult photos window, but many association issues can be fixed by checking the sync photos and making sure that they weren't entered incorrectly. Once any mistakes have been fixed in the sync shots and your photos are all associated, you can begin fixing any time bucket mistakes that were made in the field. Double click a node or section to view its associated photos. If you need to move any photos due to association mistakes made in the field, you can click and drag those photos to the correct node or section. After dragging the photo to the correct location, click Move Photo. Once all of your photos are associated to the right locations, you can start processing your data. Double click a node to view its information. If you need to add poll tag or birthmark data, you can do so by clicking Add Attribute. Start typing the attribute you would like to add, then select it to add the attribute to the node's information. If you would like to add attributes to multiple polls at once, open the Power Tools and then click Multi-Add Attribute. Select the attribute that you'd like to add, then select whether you'd like to add, overwrite, or remove the chosen attribute. Then select whether you'd like to perform that edit on specific types of nodes, all nodes, or chosen nodes. If you click Choose Nodes, you will then be prompted to either click each node or draw a polygon around the chosen nodes. Click Finish when you're done. Once your attributes have been added, use your field data to complete those fields. To enter tags or birthmark information, click the photo to pull it up while you enter details in the node information panel.
Continue entering data until your node information is complete. To remove an attribute, click the three dot menu in the upper right, then select Remove Attribute or Photo. A trash can will appear to the left of each attribute as well as the upper left of each photo. Remember, you can always edit and create new attributes using the model editor. In the next video, we'll talk about measuring heights.